Vin Diesel and the writing staff of Fast and Furious are getting on my last damn nerve. You remember the scene that took place during the Tokyo Drift timeline, but technically happened after Fast 6 and during Furious 7, setting up Deckard Shaw as the villain for Furious 7? Yeah, it made no fucking sense, right? Well, here are the writers doing the exact same fucking thing, but with Jason Momoa this time. And it also happens to be during Fast 5 this time, so it was, technically it was way earlier in the timeline. You guys remember the super macho man like standoff between Dwayne Johnson and Vin Diesel in Fast 5? Oh, best believe we're getting it in 10. We're gonna get a second one. Did you guys enjoy Hobbs and Shaw? Well, too bad, kids. We have Han and Shaw. I don't know what the fuck's going on anymore. Then there was the amazing stunt craft that was them jumping cars out of planes. They actually did this stunt. They were just looking for any excuse to do it again. Just any excuse to do it again. Jason Momoa kidnaps Dom's son. That that, remi that reminds me of something. That, that really reminds me of something. Just that it was the entire plot of fucking Fast 8. Jesus fuck. Vin Diesel, what is going on in your studio? Like, I cannot be the only person who is just fucking done with this shit. Like, please just stop. Just stop making these. Like, what is even going on anymore? You're literally just repeating ideas. I swear to God, if I see a car jump through a, four buildings instead of three buildings, I'm going to headbutt whoever is sitting in front of me.